Here we are at St Cross Cricket Ground for a wonderful match between St Cross and the Rifles Officers Cricket Club. So, Jalen, hello. Tell us about it. Um, and who have you got with you? Well, I've got Marv here. He's our overseas this year. Excellent. Um, I've heard he's alright. I've never actually seen him fold, but I've heard he's alright. Took seven two weeks ago, is it? Yeah. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a nice guy too. Wow, wow, that sounds good. You look like <laughs> yeah. a nice guy. Where are you from, Marv? I'm from South Africa. Cape Brilliant. Yeah. Ah, fantastic, fantastic. And uh, interesting T-shirt you got there, Jalen. Yeah, yeah. Some, some of the new merch. Obviously, well, you might want to buy some. This is one of the first ones we've made. Um, fits me well, but it doesn't fit Dad very well. No, it's, uh, it's a bit snug on me, so uh, I've given it to him. Anyway, uh, chaps, you're batting first. Mm -hmm. Won the toss. Yeah, so. so nice, lazy uh, two hours or so before lunch. He might be batting. Ah, brilliant. Oh, that'd be Got a good bit to of see. a gap to order today, so looking forward to that. But um, yeah, no, obviously we, we won the toss. Skips put 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 them into bowl. Um, Jenny at St. Cross it, it does a little bit up front, but once you get in here, a lot of runs out there um, normally flattens out. Um, Love it. Touch on the slow side, um, but again, if you're in, a lot of runs out there. So yeah, hopefully the boys uh, get a good score and then we'll back our bowlers to go and do the job. Excellent. Very good. Well, I look forward to that. Good luck. Stunning. Cheers. Thanks, fellas. Yeah. Cheers. Ooh, it's a magnificent shot. Get off the mark. Oh, Ooh, that's a this tremendous shot. There. You dream of receiving. Absolutely. So, so uh, slow, slow, long off. You just lean on it. Jimmy Adams here, facing ex-Hampshire player. Scored thirteen thousand runs for Hampshire, and uh, yeah, looking pretty good. Ooh, Tom Ford getting a loose one and making no mistake there. Lovely shot. So yes, with the county player Adams and skipper, first team skipper Tom Foyle, opening the batting. Just hoping for a, hoping for a bit of quality today, and I'm so far looks like we're getting it. And it's a beautiful day here. It's uh, 20 odd degrees. Another four there. Um, yeah, I've heard it might get dark and stormy later, but uh, hopefully, hopefully it won't. Well, Skipper Foyle uh, likes to get on with it, but then if he's fed balls like that, I think we all do. Uh, quite a feisty start here. A little bit of context here. This is the Rifles Officers Cricket Club's Cricket Week. Uh, they have a, oh, that's a magnificent shot. Well, before I was rudely interrupted by that... Uh, Lovely shot from Jimmy Adams. The Rifles Officers Cricket Club, uh, they, um, ooh, this is their home ground and they share it with uh, St Cross, some Indians. Um, and the Rifles Officers Cricket Club is uh, also amalgamated, I believe, with the Green Jackets Cricket Club. So quite a lot of uh, army history here. Ooh, that's a short ball and that's uh, murdered. Well, this really is proper cricket, isn't it? Oh, and that's uh, got away with that. Side the way. Get a couple for it. Come back for three. And another lovely shot from Jimmy Adams. This is an all day game, despite the rather feisty start from St. Cross. Yeah, it's an all-day game. We started at 11.30. I'll find out what time we're finishing shortly. Ooh. Big full toss and that's gone away again. Foil this time. Well, keeper standing up now, same bowler. And 49 for none. Uh, the officers need a wicket. Ooh, they're not going to get one with that. That's a uh, six. More like a nine. Which reminds me, uh, take me back to Jalen's t-shirt, which actually was, uh, well, it's the first, it's the first sight. Oh, and that's a six, and that really is more like a nine. That's gone on to the, uh, that's gone on to the second 11 pitch, over the hedge. Fantastic shot. Wow. I might have to get Jimmy one of those six more like a nine t-shirts. Um, yeah, they're part of our merch range, our Silas CC TV shop. Uh, with a range of merchandise and some some of the silly sayings that I come up with. Uh, link below. Um, all I'd say is if you order any clothing, order a size bigger than you would normally. Otherwise, the quality is lovely. 
Oh, that's a lovely shot. Tom Foyle this time, joining the party. Oh, magnificent shot. Adams moves into the 40s now. 74 for none in the eighth over. Oh, a rare play and miss. Ah, another magnificent shot. Really is different gravy today. Yeah, this uh, new bowl at this end. A bit better line in length. Putting a few dots together. Oh, that's a lovely shot for four. And uh, yeah, the opening roll from this end just asked me to get him a glass of water. So, as he's an officer, I better do it. Well, would you believe it? Whilst getting that glass of water, bloody wicket fell. Uh, so Tom Foyle, the man out. Um, miscue drive, apparently. I didn't see it because I was getting a glass of water for the opening batsman, the bowler. God, blimey, the liberties of these officers. Anyway, um, we carry on. Harry Trussler, the new man in at three. Bowling. He's off the mark. Oh, here's Budgie, the uh, bowler. See if he's refreshed after his glass of water. Yeah, seems so. Ooh, that's a huge hit into the net. And that's uh, Adam's 50. Applause there, much deserved. Came up in rapid time. Joy to watch. Well, and that's six more like a nine reminds me. Those T-shirts are available in a range of colours and lots of different types of apparel and accessories available too. Score at drinks. Go for a bit of shade under the tree there. And why not? So, Budgie's back. He's had his glass of water. He's rung the bell, looked in the mirror, sharpened his beak on a bit of cuttlefish and, and it's working. Oh, what a lovely shot there, Trussler. Regular viewers will recognise this ground. It's where Southampton University played uh, their home games. Sadly, not in weather as glorious as this. It's been a miserable season. But it's getting good now. Oh, and that's caught and bowled. Good catch. And that's 103 for two. It's the 16th over. Matt Howarth coming in at four. Jimmy Adams saying, well, it's all pretty easy out here, Matt. You can uh, smack it all around the park. Why don't you? Good bit of pressure being applied here with the uh, good line and length and a little bit of wobble from this bowler. Both bowlers, good stuff. Oh, that's a nice shot. Nobody really moved. It's gone straight into the lunch tent. That's a nice shot. Yeah. Full task put away in some style. Oh, a lovely shot again. Oh, and it's another four. Oh, that's chipped over. And one bounce and a satisfying clang on the sight screen. St Cross march on. Adam's on to 78 now and uh, with about 20 minutes to lunch uh, we have what looks like a bit of spin coming into the attack. Um, and well, why not? Ooh. Got away with that. Man in the deep. Through and four. And again. The back foot that time. Trussler getting free. Oh, and that's given him. That was uh, definitely pad first. So, Adams goes before lunch. 
for 79 is 142 for three. And just just looking at Jimmy Adams' stats, first class, actually scored 14,000 runs for Hampshire with a top score of 262 not out, um, an average of 37, included 25 centuries. So, uh, yeah, privilege to film. Um, really, really great innings there. Marvin Williams in at five, a St Cross overseas player from Cape Town, South Africa. We had a little chat with him earlier on the game, and uh, he's a bowler, but uh, strikes me as a sort of chap that likes to give the ball a bit of a bash. Oh, that's uh, bowled in. Lovely delivery. That's now four down, 147, 25th over just before lunch. St Cross need to consolidate. Oh, driven away through the slips. Lovely shot. <laughs> Excellent setup here at St Cross. There's an outdoor barbecue area and bar there, and that's beautifully, beautifully chipped away through mid wicket for four from Howarth. Oh, that's a loose ball. And that's uh, gone for six. Oh, that's a nice shot over the top, over extra for four. And Harry leaning on his back there is the sort of chap that thinks, well, sod this plane for lunch, Lark. If it's there, I'm going to hit it. And why not? Oh, and that's a, another lovely shot. Probably won't go. Oh, and he's... <laughs> I think he's got a different idea about what playing for lunch means. I rather like it. Pretty good platform there from which to launch after after lunch if people stay off the booze for long enough. Jalen will be in after lunch. Ooh, that's a loose one. That's put away for four. And that's 50 for Howie. Back really well actually. Looking very good. Oh, a little inside edge and that's going to run away for four. Ah, shot by Dabbers. Teaser. Oh, that's a nasty one, just bouncing shy of him. It's got away for four. Proper, lovely cover drive from Dabbers. And that's unlucky. Budgie bowling really well here in the post-lunch spell. Must be tough. Opening bowler back on. A little bit of tap from Jimmy Adams and Tom Ford. And there's a misfield there. I think that's going to go. There it does. Oh, that's a magnificent delivery, and it's out. Well, bold there. That's two eighteen for five. It's the thirty seventh over. Oh, and that's an easy catch. That was a not a great ball, but picked off his legs well, but straight to square leg. How it goes for a well made sixty. off the mark in characteristic style with a four. Well, after three pints and a couple of pims, I assume that Jalen is uh, hitting the ball that's in the middle. And another. Jalen goes for it. Don't think he's quite got that. Long chase. A couple of runs. Oh, it's definitely going for the uh, declaration by the looks of it. Another four. Oh, that's more like it. That's uh, six. Into the sight screen. 
Short one, pulled away. And that's gone too, another teaser. Oh, Jalen raced up to 29. Well, the way these two are batting, it looks like there's probably about 15, 20 minutes of declaration. Oops, oh, there'll be two here, another misfield. The rifle's getting a little bit ragged now, but it's unsurprising, it's been a hot day. 258 for six. A double teapot from the umpire there. Oh, that's a nasty old smear, but it's straight and it's four. Well, a new bowler comes on, but I've just seen the skipper's signal that this is the last over before the declaration. Oh, that's uh, got to be out, and it is. I think uh, Jalen walked there. Um, yeah, so all guns blazing now. That's 264 for seven. Should be two here. Turn and go. Over the top. That's four. Wasn't pretty, but highly effective. So last ball, I think. Probably going to chance it for two. No. Wise choice. So that is the declaration. There we have it, 273. Two, Four, eight. And there'll be about, probably about three hours of, three, and, three hours, ten minutes of uh, batting time. Don't know how many overs that might be. Probably 47, 48, who knows. Well stuck at it, the rifles. Hot out there. So James Allen opened the bowling after 29 runs off 14 balls and three pints of lager and a couple of pims. Well, it's a President's Day, isn't it? Oh, well. Sam Kendall opening up the other end. Bit of wobble there. Run away, first boundary. Ooh, that's a tempted slow ball, back of the hand job. Four runs. Well, it's a steady start. Um, neither batsman nor bowler's really dominating as yet. Oh, there's no one there, that's going to be four. Oh, well. Oh, and that's well bowled. Pitched up, got him playing across the line, and that's uh, 37 for one, it's the 10th over. Oh, snicks away through third slip, vacant third slip, four runs. It's in the air, but that's over the top and away for four. Ooh, and that's a big full toss and a big six. Ooh, and uh, big four that time. Oh, the rifle's beginning to uh, consolidate here. Jamie Cork replacing Jalen at 62 for one in the 13th over. That's a lovely shot. And a double change brings Josh Murlock into the attack. And well bowled. That's a lovely shot.
That's a nice shot over the top for four. That's T88 for one. Well, that was a magnificent tea um, with some of the finest tiffin that I've ever had. Uh, someone said, oh, that's uh, four through the slips. Someone said they're made by Jenny Adams, who I think might be Jimmy Adams' mum anyway. Who, Jenny Adams, whoever you are, congratulations on your tiffin. It's absolutely excellent. What a nice angle here. We'll just see in the background there. It's the, uh, every club has them. It has their codgers, ex-players who still come up and have a beer and there we have I rather suspect the St Cross Codgers enjoying their Friday afternoon beer marvellous oh that's nice work but oh dear ruined by the throw and the backing up and that's uh, buzzers oh oh and that's gone it might be a little high, but uh, hey ho, that's um, that's two down, much needed wicket. Chap was playing very, very well indeed, doing everything right. Um, so could be interesting. Bowling. Oh, a bowl. No, not out. Even if you do appeal twice. Oh, that's great fielding. That's what you expect from your overseas pro. Oh, that's scooped up. Should be. And it is. Easily taken. That's uh, three down now. 114. And Jamie Court continues. And that's uh, smacked away in fine style. A decent bat, this guy. Oh, that's a short ball picked up beautifully. And it's six. And it's a 24th over. It's 127 for three and not before time. Bit of spin into the attack. Mark Padwick with his right arm rounds. It's a good start. And Jimmy Adams. Hampshire. Cricketer coming on for a bowl. Got a left arm round. Oh, that's 50 there. Well played. Fletch, as I've heard him being called. Yeah, really, really good batsman. Excellent knock. Oh, 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 magnificent. <laughs> oh, that's a big old wipe. That's a six. More like a... Cool. More like a 12. Well, the rifle's beginning to fire now. Ooh, and that's... Could be. It just dropped short. Oh, that's lofted over the top. A four. Oh, and that's gone. And that's uh, a much needed wicket there. The rifles were uh, looking quite comfortable, but it's always going to be wickets that do this. So, yeah, that's now 151 for four. It's the 29th over. Oh, we're into the final hour now, so. Uh, 20 overs must be bowled, potentially more, but highly unlikely. And uh, the rifles need 120 to win, so six and over with six wickets in hand. And St Cross need all those six wickets for them to win. This is proper cricket. All oh, nicely flighted. It's gone up to Moo Moo, corner. And uh, four runs. Much needed boundary there, the rifles. So final 15 overs need a hundred and 
11. That's about 7.4 and over. Well, 7, 7.4 and over, 15 overs left. Six wickets in hand. As they say, the scene is set. Ooh, just six over. That's just going to be one. And it's Colts night and practice night. Amazing facilities here. Two sets of nets, one here. Jimmy Adams was a Colt here. And went to play a bit of England under 19 stuff and then Hampshire for many, many years. And now he's come back, which is great to see. And that's gone before. And there are the other nets in the in the second ground. Oof. Precious building. 98 needed off 12. Oh, and that's uh, played on. Again, pressure brought to bear. That left hander in at seven, and he's got work to do. Nice shot. Lovely shot. Four runs. Oh, and that's nice, and that could be a six. It's not, it's just uh, just bounces short. Another lovely shot. And the bowler bravely keeps the man in. Give him another chance. Oh, that's great work. <laughs> yeah, real good, Joshy. Off from the throw. That's a nice shot. That'll run away. That expensive over there. Um, for St Cross and... Uh, the Ruffles need 83 off 10. And we brought Dabbers on. Oh, that's the old trusty boot. Save three runs. And Harry comes on. Uh, a big score in the first innings. Normally bowls a bit of pace, but... Uh, Cricket week, he's tossing it up a bit today. Oh, and that's a horrible ball. Four runs. Well, one gets the feeling that uh, Howie is is playing the role that Dell might play in our Sunday eleven. You know, you've got to keep the keep the opposition interested enough to keep going for it. Because uh, you know, we've got to bowl them out and cross out. Oh, and that's hit him on the helmet. No ball. I think he's all right. Army, you see. It's just going to be one. Well, 58 needed off seven. Jalen comes back into the attack. And straight away he's hit for a glorious four. Oh, that's in there. Oh, he's stumbled down here. That's wouldn't have got there. And they come back for two. Rolling. Oh, that's a magnificent hit. That's a six, more like a nine. Tremendous slap. Oh, and that's a, a much needed wicket. Uh, the rifles keeping up with this run rate. But now six down, 232. Just five overs left, I think. There we go. Rifles need 42 off five. St. Cross need four wickets. And that could be four runs. Bit of a loose sniff and Jalen. And that's 100. Well batted, young man. That was a really, really superb, superb innings. Magnificent. Bowl. 33 needed off four. Oh, and that's hit really well. Uh, that's four runs. The slower ball. Oh, that's a great effort. Great effort. Just bouncing before him. Oh, that's uh, through his hands there. That's the single. And it's, uh, it's getting quite tense here. All results are on the cards. That's just one. Oh, 
And that's well bowled. 27 needed off three. Oh, another high one, and that's gone away for four. It's just chipped over, should be a couple. Twenty one of fourteen balls. Oh, that's a ball. Twenty one of thirteen. Everyone going back now. Don't mind giving this guy a single. No, they don't take it. Final 12 balls. And that's uh, out. That's pretty crucial wicket. That's uh, the man on 107. He's gone superb. Knock. Um, probably gone with him are the rifle's chances of winning this game. Let's see. Okay, 21 of 11. And that's well bowled. Not out. Oh, oh, and that's uh, that's hurt him. But uh, they come back for a second, and the batsman's hobbling around. My word, everyone's struggling. Oh, stopped it with his boot. Trusty boot. There's seven balls left, I think. Three wickets or 19 runs. It's floated up, got away with it. 19 needed off. Six balls. That's just a, a single. Seventeen off four. Oh. Just a bye. Three wickets needed, one a ball. Oh, this superb game of cricket is looking destined for a draw. Certainly, they've made sure, St. Cross have made sure they can't lose this game. And that's squirted away for four runs. Ooh, could be a consolation wicket here for Jalen. And there is. So uh, that's the rifles finished. 264 for eight. Nine runs short. What a great game of cricket. Lovely day here at St Cross. Splendid stuff. Handshakes all round. spirit that this game's been played in. Tremendous example for anyone. Uh, highlights probably Jimmy Adams getting an excellent 78-79 and uh, Fletch, and his full name from the Rifles, getting an excellent 107. Splendid stuff. Where do they serve Pilgrim here? <laughs> 